Welcome to Bungaboo TV's latest program, Falang Day. My name is Sunny Burns and I'm also a Thai language student fighting to practice my speaking skills. I'm lucky that I live in Thailand where I get to practice my speaking skills every day. That's why we've created Falang Day. This program is giving language students a chance to practice their speaking skills in a real life situation. Each week we'll give our guests a mission. Their mission is to speak English for five minutes and they have a chance to win 1,000 baht. Let's welcome our guest for today. Kab, hello, how are you? Uh, I'm fine. Thank when, you. Normally when I meet um, a male, I, I shake their hand. Ah, okay. How are you going, good? Good, I'm fine. So can you please introduce yourself? Uh, my name is Thanapon mm -hmm. Nomswa. My okay. name is Don. Okay. And can you tell me a little bit more about yourself? Uh, I'm male. Uh -huh. uh, Are you sure? I'm, of course. Okay. I'm 34 years old uh -huh. and uh, I'm working freelance. Okay. Uh. So, you have a mission today. Uh -huh. Your mission is to speak English for five minutes. Okay? Extra points will be awarded for no dead air. <laughs> and to ask lots of questions. If you complete the mission, I will give you 1,000 baht. Okay? okay? If you fail, then I will keep the 1,000 baht. <laughs> so, as requested, your topic today is Thai style. Are you ready? I guess so. Okay, I hope so too. <laughs> okay, stopwatch, are you ready? Okay, three, two, one, let's go. I style, uh, let's talk about food. Okay. Uh, what, what, what kind of food do you like that uh, Thailand has? What type of food do I like? So I really love Khor Mu Yang. Khor Mu Yang. But my favorite food in Thailand is a little bit weird is Gung Ten. Gung Ten. Gung Ten. Gung Ten. Like dancing ah, Gung, okay. dancing shrimp. Sure yeah, I have it at Hoi Kwang Market. Hoi Kwang Market, Hoi Kwang Market. has really delicious. Is it's a uh, boiling? Boiling? No, I think it's normal. They normal. get the the prawns out of the fish tank, uh -huh. and they put it in a bowl, and they mix it with Thai fresh fresh shrimp. I mean, yeah. uh, krill. Life, is it krill? Krill. Yeah. Krill. Krill is a little shrimp. Little little shrimp, I think. Ah. Yeah. Because my um, Thai friends are from Izan, uh -huh. so they uh -huh. they eat all unique uh -huh. Thai food. Another Thai Thai thing. What, what about uh, TV show? Oh, drama. TV shows. Oh, I love um, TV series in Thai. I'm very addicted really? to watching Thai TV shows because I'm a Thai language student. The best way to learn a second language is from watching TV shows, mm -hmm. and when the the boys were stuck in the cave. Uh. I was watching the um, the news every five minutes. Are the boys free yet? I love watching um, that story about the Thai news. And um, what about travel? Travel. Travel in any place in Thailand. Uh -huh. Do you have any favorite? I love Bangkok. Bangkok is my favorite. I mean, I mean, uh, outdoor. Oh, outdoors. outdoors. Um, where do I like to go? I really like going to um. Phuket. Uh -huh. I like Phuket. I like Lip Pet. Lip Pet. Lip Pet. Lip, lip Pet. Oh, Just okay. I always it. say it wrong. Let's forget it. Just forget it. <laughs> also, you a sea type guy. Pardon? Sea. Yeah, I'm a beach boy. We say beach, beach boy. Oh, beach boy. Okay. I'm a beach boy because in Australia, I always lived by the beach. Uh, and yeah. you called uh, people who like sea beach boy. Correct, yeah. And what about people who like uh, forest or nature? <laughs> Oh, a forest person? In the Chinese, we don't say forest person. I don't know. And about any Thai, any Thai culture that you uh, love? Okay, what do I love about Thai culture? Thai culture has um, like Glen Jai. Ah, so what Glen is Glen Jai in English? Glen Jai is really, really hard to translate. Yeah, I think yeah. it's like being considerate. I think Kwam Glen Jai is about being considerate. And I love that about Thai culture is the Glen Jai. I love that. I think, I think in English there's no word that yeah. translates 
กรงใจ Yeah I think so as well uh, I think the closest word to เกรงใจ is considerate Ah uh, yes But like still it's still a it's little a bit little different. different It's about the thinking Yes yes Keep going keep going You're doing I'm, a good I'm thinking, job I'm thinking I'm thinking uh, uh -huh. What about uh, that famous Thai smile Thai smile yeah. Hmm You know, a lot of people say that Thailand is the land of smiles. Yes. But I think in Australia, a lot of Australians smile as well. Uh. So I also think Australia is the land of smiles. But when a p h a l a n g in Australia is angry, uh -huh. they do not smile. Okay. But I feel if a Thai person is angry or they don't understand, then they smile a lot. Because I remember. A long time ago, I had a, like a little fight with my Thai friend. Uh -huh. We're still friends now, <laughs> but um, they kept smiling when we we're fighting. I'm like, we're trying to have a fight, but why are you smiling? I mean, to ease the tension. I don't know. I don't know. But I guess in Australia, a lot of people um, smile as well. So I guess it depends on the culture. I think if you go to Russia, ah. no one smiles. Because I used before learning uh -huh. Thai, I used to learn Russian, Russia. and I went to Russia, and no one smiled. But if you go to Australia, everyone goes, "Hey, buddy! Hey, mate! Hey, dear! Hey, love! How uh -huh. are you today?" So for me, I find that Thai culture is a little bit like Australian culture, in terms of everyone is smiling and saying hello to each other. Do you smile a lot? Yes, I do. Can I see your smile? That's why I have wrinkles here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, time's up. Oh, good job, mate. How do you feel that you went with um, your English today, your speaking skill? So I don't 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 use much of the uh, speaking skill mm -hmm. because you know I'm I'm always in front of my computer. Okay. Uh, so I don't speak much. <laughs> so I'm going to give you a little bit of feedback about how you went. I think you did a really good job. Okay, thank um, you. You should feel really proud that you had a go and you didn't <laughs> give up. Um, so there was a few words that we mentioned. Yeah. So there was a beach boy. So a beach boy is someone who loves the beach. But today you have won 1,000 baht. Congratulations! Thank you. I'll give it to you after. Okay. Thank you. Very much. All right. So thank you so much for joining us today. So that's all that we have time for today. So if you want to join our show, send us a message on Facebook, or you can watch us on Bungaboo TV. And remember, your English doesn't have to be perfect. It's about trying and having a go. Thank you and goodbye. Bye. Bye. Bungaboo TV.